What's up you guys? Welcome back and welcome if you're new. In today's video, I'm right here in Holcomb Creek and the cool thing about today's video, it's gonna be a Tacoma versus 4Runner versus FJ. Let me go ahead and introduce to you guys who's here. So you guys probably already know him just by his looks and of course his 4Runner. So go check him out on Mammoth 4Runner on Instagram. He's pretty famous on there, I'm not gonna lie. I know you're being <laughs> humble, but it's the truth. <laughs> so that's his rig here and we also have one more guest with us. So of course his uh, FJ is going to be right here. You want to go ahead and say your Instagram as well? Freedom FJ 4x4. Hell yeah. So if you guys ahead. don't know him yet, make sure to check it out. I'll, I'll link it down below as well. So today we're just going to go ahead and test out our rigs. As you can tell, they're all pretty built. So it's going to be awesome to see how we do here. If you guys haven't checked out that trail, look it up. YouTube videos, look up anything like that. You guys will see where we're at. It's not easy. Let's get to it. How you doing guys? Freedom FJ 4x4 here. Just giving you a rundown of the rig. Got Toy Tech coils in the front, Icon Delta joint, KM3s for tires, got the Metal Tech 4x4 LT kit, Icon suspension, here representing FJs for the showdown today. Mammoth 4Runner here, quick rundown, 315s, KM3, Kings, Icon, let's do it, holding down for 4Runners. Jesse Rizzo here for my suspension, I have an iBox Stage 2 Pro Lift, uh, in the rear I have uh, Dakar OME uh, Leaf Pack. And then I do have some bump stops. For tires, I have Toyo Open Country RTs. Let's get it. Before we do start the video, uh, please make sure to comment down below who you think is gonna do the best. Me with the Tacoma, Mammoth 4Runner with the 4Runner, or our friend over there with the FJ. Comment down below. What's up guys, No Chill Nate here, uh, rocking the camera in my Columbia Trailbeater uh, hiking boots. Uh, if I sound like I'm out of breath, it's because I'm following these trucks on foot. Let's get it. You gotta bump it. Yeah, there we go. A little bit if you're trying to avoid this rock. Okay, now bring it back in here so you'll cut down right there. Okay, now You're going up. Come start coming right. Straight. Now just straight out. Yeah. Okay. Driver or passenger, passenger, hard passenger. Star coming, passenger. Turn driver and back up. All right. Right there, now turn passenger and bring it straight to me. Uh-oh. Yeah, right. Back up more, back up more. Back up. Right there. Now, now all the way passenger. There we go. Bring it towards me. Right there. There we go. Now go all the way and follow him, actually. Keep going now. You're gonna come up on the back. You're gonna have to back up and bump. There. Now just go straight. There you go. Oh, right there. He pushed his the rock under his dip. Don't back up. Don't back 
back up. So, yeah. You Can you move forward? <laughs> there was always one. He's hung up on the diff. You're gonna have to bump it harder. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You good? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah. There's nothing in Disappointed. The way. Just... All right, you guys, we just finished up that first section. Uh, I'll be honest, it was a little bit more technical than I actually thought. Uh, wrong placement on my tires and just kind of, I, I picked the wrong line again. Uh, so it just it got me hung up. I know that probably uh, looked not that bad on camera. But yeah, so there's still two more sections that I could redeem myself. So make sure you guys let me know what you guys thought back there. Another thing I did want to touch on, I do have 33s. Keep that in mind. These guys that I'm going with, they both have 35s. So that might play a difference too in this trail today. Uh, but I don't want to blame it on that. Let's just keep going and see if I make it through those other two. Go ahead and comment down below what you guys think. you guys so right here we're in the second section uh we'll go ahead and flip the camera in a bit but i want to show you guys so we came in through this like little forest looking section of course it's not but yeah uh there was some water there and now flipping the camera this way as you guys can see it's nice and rocky so um what how long do you think it would take <laughs> slow and steady man yeah, yeah. just yeah. getting this all through as long as, as it one has one rig still so damn as long so, yeah. as it's gonna take <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. So this is supposed to be, I guess, the second section. You would say the hardest? I would probably. say this is the hardest spot for it. Alright, so we'll go ahead and try to capture it for you guys on the camera. It might not do justice, uh, but let's get it. So I don't know if you guys can tell. Rocks are pretty big. Nice and solid right here. Yeah, FJ for the win, you guys. Passenger. Forerunner or Tacoma. What do you think? You're up on the rock now. Start turning, turning, uh, start turning driver to get some uh, tire under you. Harder driver. There we go. Just bring it straight. There we go. Now start turning passenger. There we go. Keep that wheel placement. Driver, driver, there we go. Driver more. There we go. Driver. You're going to teeter. There we go. Now bring it straight in. There we go.
You ready for that? Never really. <laughs> I'm pretty worried now. <laughs> High centered over there. High centered here. Now I'm scared. <laughs> it's in the tailgate. How do you feel? Good? It's all good. Hell yeah. It's all part of the fun. <laughs> Ready? It's bending it too much. Say again? It's the tire is bending too much. The what? The tire is bending in a little bit. 